Our, our top story tonight on News 12 Connecticut, a convicted felon accused of brutally killing his infant daughter and then evading capture for two weeks, making his first court appearance. Christopher Francis Queenie is now being held on over $6.4 million bond and won't be released even if he can post it. News 12 Connecticut's Marissa Alter reports from Waterbury Superior Court. It was a packed courtroom for Christopher Francis Sweeney's arraignment. Family and friends of baby Camilla were there, some of them wearing shirts with her picture on them and pink ribbons. Members of the Naugatuck Police Department also attended. They were pink in Camilla's honor. Surrounded by several marshals, Christopher Francis Sweeney kept his head down, never acknowledging the judge or his public defenders as he was arraigned for murder with special circumstances. This involves the death and horrific mutilation of a child two weeks before her first birthday. Francis Sweeney is accused of stabbing, strangling, and dismembering his 11-month-old daughter Camilla inside their home. Naugatuck police said he then went to Waterbury, where he had a fight with Camilla's mother, during which he cut off his court-mandated GPS ankle monitor and fled. A multi-state manhunt came to an end Friday afternoon after a community member recognized Francis Sweeney at a bus stop and called police. Behind your back. He is an extreme risk for flight. There is an extreme risk to public safety. Judge Joseph Schwartz agreed and set bond at $5 million for the murder and more than $1.4 million for additional pending cases. The judge also issued protective orders for three people, including Camilla's mom. You understand all that, sir? No response? Camilla's family didn't talk publicly after court, but her mom spoke at a vigil over the weekend to celebrate what would have been Camilla's first birthday. Every day you see your daughter, every day, and then one day it just stops. I don't know how I'm going to do it. Francis Sweeney is set to appear in Bridgeport Superior Court Tuesday and Milford Superior Court Wednesday on charges he failed to show up there on pending cases while he was on the run the past two weeks. In Waterbury, Marissa Alter, News 12 Connecticut.